What's up guys? Another beautiful afternoon here. I uh, just had a little break at work and thought I would uh, give you an update on some things, talk about some things that I want to do here in the recent future. Hope the wind noise isn't too bad. I'm trying out this new microphone, so we'll see when I get to editing. But first things first, I want to do a stack. The problem is with a stack, I have a toolbox and it has tools in it so I have to figure something out with that but I've wanted a stack for a long time I never pulled the trigger and I feel like it's just it's it's time to do it so let me know if y'all have any ideas on how to solve the solution with tools and everything and how you would maybe cut a hole in that and do some fab work or get rid of it entirely or put a bed cover on with a stack or I don't know so I think I'm gonna order the stack take the toolbox out for now and then figure out what to do with it later also traction bars so I have the option with 60 inch or 72 inch probably gonna get them powder coated red I've seen a 60 inch on a mega cab and it actually looks pretty decent but I uh, I might want the longer ones I'm not a hundred percent sure like I said so Leave me a message in the comments. Let me know what y'all think. And um, I'll try to pull up on the computer exactly what I want later on tonight. So we'll see you after work. So here we have uh, some choices in traction bars. These are Whirly Fab. And their price isn't too bad. Uh, $649. I don't know if that includes shipping or not and powder coating does uh doesn't add money actually so that's nice uh they look like a good kit um with the exception of this isn't welded together so you have to i mean you have to take it to a shop to do welding anyway or at least i do but it just seems to be in a few more pieces than I would like it to be um, but they do powder coat before they send them to you which is nice you don't have to take it to a paint shop as long as they show up and they're the right color I have CPP with a bolt-on kit it's only 550 bucks again I don't know if that includes shipping but uh, I don't know how I feel about a bolt-on kit it feels like there's a lot more room for error and it could slide around and cause more issues and feel like welding a kit on is much more solid and if you want to take them off you could always cut it off and just paint over where it was on the frame it's not that big of a deal but I do like their price um, and they do paint them for you but I don't like I mean my trucks red and I can choose red but I don't know if it's the right color red what if it's a completely different red and then it looks worse than if I just got black then we have DNR Customs, who uh, I got from Greg A. They have this awesome kit right here for only 395 bucks without the tubing. But if you get the tubing, or actually, they, no, they won't even send you the tubing. They only send you the tubing if you're getting it installed in-house. So I can't drive to them, so I can only order this kit, and I'd have to get my own tubing which is not something that I really want to do. I don't know if it's that hard, but you know, I'd rather just buy the complete kit even if it costs a little bit extra to do that. I don't have to go buy this kit and then buy a tubing and then take it to get painted and take it somewhere else to get welded. That's just... <coughs> that's crazy. It's nonsense. Then, number one front runner right now, Rough Stuff Specialties from the Far From Stock store they have i mean this is the same truck i have mega cab 06 mega cab um and i believe he has this 60 inch bars on there which look good they're not too short not too long 332 dollars and that doesn't include shipping I'm sure it doesn't include painting, but they can paint for you, powder coat, whatever you need to get done. So with powder coating, you probably get 
um, a closer color and if they're not giving you selections on colors you can probably tell them exactly what you want and get the exact color of your truck or something completely custom if you want it that way as well um, I, I really think this is a good price and I'll probably order my stack through them as well I'll show you that in a second so maybe they'll um, you know chip, shipping will be cheaper from doing two things at once and I don't know we'll see but this kit it's full well done kit but it looks really nice a nice big heim joints and uh, two inch DOM tubing brackets look solidly welded I don't know I don't think I could go wrong with this kit now we are gonna get into the stack I love this stack and they claim that it doesn't have near as much drone and it's not quite as loud in the cab as other stacks because this is made out of good quality stuff the thing that I like about it is they give you the option for the 4 and the 5 inch uh, exhaust and they send you everything that you're going to need to install this I believe it comes with the flex pipe and everything so they can also paint this. I'll probably just get a black one. I don't know if I have a design on it or this far from stock logo. Uh, Y'all let me know in the comments what you would prefer. Um, I'm just thinking a gloss black would look good, sleek, clean, and won't show soot as much. I'm already going to have to clean my roof off from that. Um, also with the traction bars, they're probably going to be red, but let me know your opinion on that as well. What And also what length I should get and um, who I should go with. If y'all have an opinion, if you have traction bars already and you've had good experience, bad experience, what have you, just let me know. So guys, there's the options on traction bars and stack. Um, I still need help with the whole toolbox thing. I haven't decided what I want to do always open to subject suggestions so leave in the comments please like this video subscribe uh, we have a lot more co content coming past the stack and traction bars but I feel like this is the first step that I want to go and see some visual um, changes before I, I add more horsepower because horsepower was the last thing that I did and I like doing it in steps so yeah subscribe stay tuned like this video comment let me know what you think Peace.